You must know and understand that for all scientists, the key to good work is tireless and repeated experimentation and observation until a theory has been proved or disproved. Therefore, you must observe above all things and collect evidence. Yes, then and only then can you formulate laws. You must understand and know that medicine, science, philosophy, astrology, and music are somehow all one, all drawn together by a bond of mystery. You must also know that science is a combination of common sense, persistence, and imagination. What are they doing down there? That you don't want to know. All right, you think the sun rises and sets on Aristotle. Now's the time to prove or disprove one of his many theories. Whatever. I've tried this experiment already in Pisa, but I will repeat it for the benefit of my empty-headed new student. Now, which will hit the ground first? This one. Fine. Watch what happens and prepare to be wrong. Large and small bodies of the same material do not fall at different speeds, as Aristotle stated, but at the same speed, like the cork and metal balls of the pendulum. For others. I would cheerfully drop you off the tower to prove the point. Need any help? No. No, I think I'm ready. I just hadn't expected such a crowd. The demonstration will now begin! <clears throat> oh, no. Good luck. Correct me if I'm wrong, Mr. Colombe, but you hold the belief that shape alone affects whether a solid body will sink or float in a medium such as water. Yes? Shape alone affects whether a solid body sinks or floats in water. I will now prove my theory. <laughs> this object will float because it is flat and thin. <laughs> This floats because it is a sphere. <laughs> this does not float because it is not flat or thin. Oops! <laughs> No, that's false. Ebony will sink to the bottom even if you make it thinner than paper, because ebony is denser than water. Whether something floats or sinks, it doesn't depend on shape at all, but on its density. Ice is less dense than liquid water. It will float due to its physical properties, not its shape. <gasps> Cosimo de' Medici, the winner. <laughs> Because of 